Hello everyone, um, today I'm going to be attempting to dye my eyebrows. Normally before lockdown I'd go to a salon or whatever to get it done but obviously we can't do that so lockdown made me do it. <laughs> yeah, I've got the Isla London dye brow in dark brown and I'm just gonna follow the instructions. I've never done this before, no idea what I'm doing but yeah it was about I don't know six pound fifty and yeah we'll just, just give it a go. Okay, so the instructions say the first step is to put like a Vaseline or petroleum jelly around your eye where you're not going to be using the um, the dye or where you don't want the dye. So I've just got this Vaseline and yeah, I'm just going to pop it around, I guess. <laughs> I've done the other eye now and it says pierce this with the end. <laughs> So that's what I'm going to do. Oh my god, it's squished out. Oh well. Okay, and then it says approximately two centimetres of it into the mixing dish, so that's what I'm going to do. Is that her eye? Okay, and then the next step is um, open activating solution away from the face, add five drops of it to the dish using the applicator mix together well. Um, okay. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. I don't know. Oh, yeah. I haven't taken the lid off. Wait, no, that is the drip. That's the drip, isn't it? Why is it? <laughs> okay, we'll go with that. Right. <laughs> okay, and then I guess we'll give it a mix. It's not mixing, it's just sticking to the wand. Um, this is not going well. <laughs> Do you need a bit more paste in it? Mm, you need a mixer. That's what they tell you to use. The applicator. Mm, it doesn't say use the applicator, it says use the applicator, mix well together. Oh yeah, to form a creamy consistency that does not rip. Alright, I guess that is the, the creamy texture. Um, and then it says apply the cream mixture to the eyebrows using the mascara wand if the cream touches the skin wipe it off immediately with damp cotton wool and I've got my cotton wool here um, I guess we'll just go for it <laughs> okay this is definitely getting a bit a bit darker I don't know if that's enough I don't know what they said to do I guess this, this must be per eyebrow so I'll just add the rest of it then? Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. But um yeah, it shouldn't look like this right now. But here we are. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. I'm gonna try and save it. Okay, this is how it's looking so far. Um I guess I'll just go ahead and do the other eyebrow. You might get 12 applications out of this, but I don't know. I definitely get 12 applications out of this, but I don't know if you get 12 out of this. I hope dark brown is the right colour for me. Otherwise... Yeah, I <laughs> <laughs> it's too light. <laughs> I mean, if it's been too light, I'm not overly fussed. I just don't want to have slug brows for the next six weeks. But yeah, just adding the activation <laughs> solution now. Um, and then give a quick mix again. And I've already prepped this eye with the Vaseline. Maybe it's not too dark. Give it a mix with the dye or the colour cream, whatever you want to call that. I think this is pretty good value for six pound fifteen, but I guess we will see <laughs> how it turns out. Okay, this I think this one went way better this time. More like thicker consistency. So I guess I'll just do the same. I think there's a lot more of this solution than there was the other. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, this one's not going as well, but it's not my favourite eyebrow anyway. <laughs> oh my god, literally everywhere. <laughs> oh my 
god. <laughs> this isn't even all the stuff yet, all the mixture. There's so much, I think I might have put too much dye on the second one, but I'll just even it out. Not going to plan. Right. Okay, let's give it a wipe. Because it's a bit messy at the moment. I think that's even. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> right, let me just even up the front of this one because there's not very much um, actual colour in the front. Why are my brow hair so long? I'm gonna have to like cut them, but I feel like that's a bad idea. And clean it up a little bit. Oh my god, it's literally everywhere. Could you all put that Vaseline down? Okay, this is how it's looking at the moment. Um, it says now to leave it for leave the cream for five to ten minutes, keeping your eyes closed. Oops. When it's done, take it off with a damp cotton wool and just wipe it off, I guess. So we will see how it looks. See you in a minute. Okay, so it's been ten minutes now. My hands are a little bit stained with dye, which makes me nervous. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. And how dark the dye is. I was trying to take a little bit off of it during the 10 minutes with the little um, wand but I don't really think it helped anyway um, we'll, we'll take it off and hope for the best I think parts of my face are stained with dye like uh, <laughs> like around here there's just like a line obviously I've got very dark slug brows right now so we'll just, just fingers crossed <laughs> I don't. It's not loads darker, but it's darker, isn't it? <laughs> I don't think it's that much darker. Right, let's take the other one off. Put it on my face. <laughs> Oops. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what she's doing. <laughs> not the first time. Okay, my eyebrows look. I'd say they're black as opposed to brown it's just very dark okay um it's not it's not as bad as i thought it'd be i thought it'd be like darker behind the like actual eye down the eyebrow even but it's not really stained the skin at all which is good this style is pretty easy to use to be honest and quite cheap but it's turned out okay so far i'm, I'm gonna do my makeup and then i will get back to you Okay, so you can probably see that I've done my makeup and everything and this line here of like dye is still not covered, like just above it. And there's also a little line of black dye here. It's all under my nails and all of my hands. And also on this side as well, it's a little bit high. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna cover it up with concealer and hope for the best, really. We'll just see how it goes. Okay, I will just carve it out and hope for the best, really. Okay, so the final verdict is, it was easy to use. However, the direction saying that using the um, Vaseline that would help it like, not go everywhere else was completely a lie. So next time <laughs> I'm going to do this, I'm going to be so much more careful. But for £6.50, it's alright. I don't think it's made the hugest difference ever. However, it's not the end of the world and it's a nice quick fix if you're... You know, if you're really, like, struggling for not going to the salon at the moment. Obviously, there's a lot of applications in here. It says 12 on the pack, but honestly, I think there's way more than 12, well, 60 drops in here. 12 sets of 5 drops. And there's, I don't know if there's enough for the 2 centimetres each time in here, but we'll see, I guess, as I use it more and more. And obviously, hopefully, in the future, I'll get better at it. Maybe I need, like, a little, I don't know, paintbrush type thing to um, cover it. But anyway went okay I'm not the best to be honest it was a little bit of a fail but maybe with time it will be better thank you for watching my video please don't forget to like and subscribe and yeah thank you for coming back to my channel see you soon bye